And then we have a log press for reps. We're thinking around 150 kilos. Uh, what do you guys think of the log press for reps? For me, it's going to be very interesting. Uh, especially the weight. It's going to be, we don't know if it's going to be 150 or, or 160 or 140 maybe. So for 160, it's going to be pretty tough for everybody. If you, We're not going to see 10 reps with it. At least I think so. <laughs> but uh, so with 150, it's going to be, yeah, uh, pretty tough still. But uh, if, if it's 140, it's going to be like maybe more like a race. Someone, yeah, if it's one minute, someone's going to get over 10 reps, I think. <laughs> yeah. I think we could assume that it's either going to be 150 or 160. I think if we look at the invite list this year compared to previous World's Strongest Man, they've made a huge point of making it as international as possible. Um, and I think, with all due respect to, to everyone invited, some people aren't as good at, at uh, their static strength set, and it's not a good look for people to get zero reps on things. So. That's why I'm thinking like 160 is probably a more world strongest man level, um, but we very well could see 150. So that everyone gets a couple of reps. But as Kim was saying, if it's one 150, there's going to be a good handful of guys in the field who just absolutely rip through 150. And if it's 60 seconds, as I'm learning in my training, so much of it has to do with your um, efficiency in cleaning and pressing and. Most of us could, could clean and press 140 all day, but can you do it without a bobble? Can you do it without um, having an issue at lockout, all that type of stuff? But um, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm really happy for that one. I'm really excited. Log's one of the very few strong main influence I, I can train on. And um, I'm up to seven at 160 and 60 seconds. So um, yeah, I, I think that's a, that's a fine event for me. Sounds, sounds astounding, actually. And are you training on a wooden log or a metal log? Uh, metal log but i have more experience on the wooden logs and i actually like it because the wooden logs are um they're more dense and so the the weight distribution is closer to the center so i find it um much easier to manage than having a 150 pound log with 200 pounds of weight on the end yeah how about you kim do you train wooden log or metal log metal log the rogue one uh yeah it's but i I have to agree with the Hoover. Uh, the wooden logs feel easier to clean, at least. Like, also feels a little lighter, even though it's the same weight. I don't know why, but uh, I like it better too. Okay. Kim, Kim, when I think of Greenland, surely you just have a, a wood log in your backyard. You could just lift pre-made. We don't. <laughs> we don't have trees here. No. What do you have? No uh, trees. Like stones, no like trees. Mount mountains. No, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> oh wow! So, so we people, have people very, very much. <laughs> yeah, it's it's very beautiful because you can see like everywhere, distant places. Like yeah, the view is awesome here. It's amazing. Yeah, so right. More like is it green? More flat. Is it green? I, is I it had green? always. <laughs> it's green in summer. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> but almost like maybe. Yeah, long time with with the snow. Yeah, right I had now, heard that uh, it's pretty snow. I had heard that, that Iceland is greener than Greenland, and Greenland is icier than Iceland. Yeah, I think it's almost the same. <laughs> yeah, where I'm from, at least. 